Now to the thousands of Oregonians that are at risk of eviction. The state is struggling to get rental assistance out fast enough. So tonight, Coin 6 follows up on the state's progress. We sent Lindsay Nadrich to speak with the program director and the Oregon Law Center, who says some renters are now out of time. It's frustrating. In some cases, it's tragic. Any eviction right now, any displacement for a tenant because they are unable to pay their rent is preventable. According to the Oregon Law Center, the state saw 361 evictions move forward in July, 462 in August, and 473 in September. But Becky Strauss, the managing attorney for the Eviction Defense Project, says these numbers are only expected to go up as the state struggles to get rental assistance out fast enough. And the processing has been so slow that we are seeing an increasing number of tenants in eviction court who are just out of time uh, with very few options. So far, 37% of households who have applied for help through Oregon's Emergency Rental Assistance Program have been paid. That we know that there are about 12,000 households who are out of time now on their protections. They're at risk of eviction right now. And about 15,000 additional households are continuing to be at risk as, as the days tick on. Oregon Housing and Community Services says they're doing everything they can to speed things up, including hiring additional staff and sending more applications to their outside vendor for faster processing. We're actively working on ways to expand the work of PPL, to hold them accountable, to hold the local program administrators accountable, and to in, you know, increase the capacity throughout the system. And those are the steps that we're continuing to take to streamline this. The state estimates it will take until the end of the year to get through the backlog. I'm Lindsay Natterich, Coin 6 News.